games that the last years have really been a Tertini moment. We kicked off these celebrations with three international musicological conferences held in Padua, Ljubljana and Trieste. The most important results of these conferences are three large volumes of expanded and edited conference papers, which are currently in print and will be published by Peter Lang. In addition, there is the edition and translation of Tartini's letters and, perhaps most importantly, the first volume of what is to be a complete edition of Tartini's musical works. There was a time in European history when Tartini was used as a symbol uh, of uh, nationalistic thought which means a symbol of something else. So let me jump uh, you know, uh, to the present and to note the fact that we are here, the new set of relations between Italy and Slovenia is also why we can celebrate together this character who is not uh, particularly Italian nor particularly Slovenian, but who is a European and we, European citizens, can be proud to work together towards a better understanding and a better diffusion of his music and of his culture. Thank you very much for your attention. We are privileged to have the opportunity to listen to two virtuosos. Federico Guglielmo and Dome Marincic performing Little Sonatas. Giuseppe Tartini rappresenti assolutamente eh, la cultura europea. Ringrazio il professor Durante per la convinzione con cui ha portato avanti la valorizzazione eh, di questo illustre cittadino padovano perché eh, le potenzialità sono enormi. Slovenia and Italy, they should cooperate, they should help those who would like to publish the work that so far has not published. I am encouraging both parts to do their job because this is the way to preserve the common European heritage. It was a lovely concert. It was great that two uh, musicians from Italy and from Slovenia came together and I really enjoyed it. I think it's important that we celebrate great artists of our past. I love Europe. I love Giuseppe Tertini.